Hi everybody, Bob with Knives Town here. Today we're taking a look at a knife by Falkneven. It's the F1 Survival Knife. This particular model is uh, made in the 3G powdered steel format, whereas uh, normally this, this is a VG10 knife. Uh, this particular model I've got here is the 3G powdered steel. We'll talk a little about that. The knife ships in bubble wrap and does come with a Zytel sheath. A uh, little bit of a uh, history about this knife. Uh, this knife is uh, has been in production for many years and since 1995 has been the the choice uh, of the uh, for the Swedish Air Force pilot survival knife. Uh, this is what the uh, what those pilots carry with them on their on their belt pack, and and it's and you, you'll notice the design is is it's a nice slim, uh, you know, lays flat type of a type of a knife. So it and the sheath also is is a, a slim narrow affair. So it, it you know it rides at the side well and doesn't take up a lot of space in a belt pack. Uh, technical specs though are 3.8 inch blade and that is 4.5 millimeters thick okay you can see it's got that that typical Scandinavian design look uh, which you know I really like is Falcon even really goes for that is it's it's everything a knife needs to be without everything a knife shouldn't be you know I mean it's just it's it's the design is frugal it's elegant it's simplistic but it's strong, it's dependable, um, it's you know really a focus on the fundamentals. The uh, the steel I did mention in this particular model is the powdered steel, laminated powdered steel. It does have a uh, thermal run handle, which is a, uh, a elastomer, which is uh, moldable and and it can be texturized. The handle in this the handle has been texturized with with uh, checkering. As you can see there, it's it's got checkering on it, uh, you know, for grip, and it's and it, and the, uh, a finger guard has been molded and made into it, so it's it's, you know, it's it's extremely weather resistant. The uh, overall uh, the length of the of the blade is 3.8 inches. The weight is six ounces. The uh, Rockwell hardness is 59. So it's a good hard steel blade, and uh, it, it's it's made for it's made for like I say it's a survival knife for the Swedish Air Force pilots. Uh, it's been designed and uh, for the the harsh environments of the winter. The 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 box that this knife comes in says that it, the the Swedish winter climate uh, played a large role in the design of this knife and the development of it. So it's it's intended for for good hard rugged outdoor use. And uh, and being a compact size, and it's really relatively lightweight at six ounces for a for a survival knife, but it 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 packs a punch. It's got everything. It's everything it needs to be. This particular model uh, that I'm holding is in in the powdered steel version is a 21st, 25th anniversary edition. Uh, it's fought and even has been in business now 25 years, and to celebrate, they brought back the powdered steel version of this knife that they had put out many years ago. Uh, they made 110 of these knives some years ago in a in a test of the 3G powdered steel and it went over so well and those knives were so so sought after that they decided for the 25th anniversary to bring back that powdered steel blade and uh, edition. There's only a thousand of these knives available the the F1 is normally available at any time in the VG10 version, but this particular version is the uh, 3G powdered steel. You'll you'll know it when you look at the blade because it does have a special marking on it. The uh, the blade has the logo. Yeah, I don't know if you can see that there. The logo with with two crowns on it. There it is. If you can catch that. It's the it's the it's the logo, and then and then you see the the crown on either side of the logo. That's how you know it's the special edition 
uh, you know, uh, of a limited edition 1,000 only. There you get a, a good view of the thickness of the steel there. This particular model, the, the uh, 1000 edition only, is available in the, only in the shiny blade. But if you're interested in the knife in, in a black blade, it is available that way with, uh, uh, in the regular VG10 format. The, the steel goes all the way through the knife, and it does, you do have a protruding tang at the rear, so that, that's good for, that makes a good, you know, pounding and, and good use as a hammer that way. The knife, the knife fits the hand very well. It's, it's got a very much of a, a, a vertical cross section there. So it's not going to twist in the hand. It's comfortable. The texturing brings good grip. The lanyard hole is a good, good sized hole there. You can see the laminate line there. It is a convex edge. So the edge, the edge curls down this way rather than just a straight point. The sheath is made of Zytel and it does click, the knife does click in like that. It does come with a thumb ramp here so that makes a nice easy push off for removing the knife. The, the knife catches, if you can see, you see how this little part rises here? I'll see if you can, I'll show it. See, as I remove the knife, that little, that little piece rises. That's catching on, on the, the finger guard right there. So as I, as, I, as I insert that knife in, into the sheath, you see that up and then down. And that's, that's how it's caught on the finger guard. Uh, to secure the knife, there is a, uh, a snap here. This is ballistic nylon and that snaps on a real good one and I like how it's got a nice long tail there for you know you've got a nice easy grab that you can grab that real easy and then get that out it does have a, a hole for drainage water drainage and it's uh, you know it's it's just your your Zytel sturdy does it is it does have the logo on it there F1 so that's your your fault even F1 limited limited edition 3g powder steel excellent excellent choice thanks for watching I'll see you again